How to set an alias in Windows command line. I used to work on Bash and benefit a lot from alias. Is there any equivalent way in Windows command line? I don't want to simulate a Linux environment, so Sigwin is not a choice. I just need some shortcut for some very long command, like, cda underscore very underscore long underscore path. As Christian.k said in his comment, the Doski command can be used to define macros, which are analogous to aliases. Macro parameters are referenced in the definition via dollar prefix positions, $1 through $9 and dollar for all. See the Doski Technet documentation, or type, Doski, question mark, or, help Doski, from the command line for more information. But there are serious limitations with Doski macros. The macros only work on the interactive command line, they do not work within a batch script. They cannot be used on either side of a pipe, both, some macro vertical bar finster caret, and dear vertical bar some macro fail. They cannot be used within a for slash f commands, for slash f percent a n, some macro, do dot dot dot, fails. The limitations are so severe that I rarely use Doski macros. Obviously you can create batch scripts instead of macros, and make sure the script locations are in your path. But then you must prefix each script with call if you want to use the script within another script. You could create simple variable macros for long and oft used commands, but syntax is a bit awkward to type, since you need to expand the macro when you want to use it. Definition Usage, from command line or script You can make a batch script and save it into your path. Add percent user profile percent backslash bin to your path environment variable. Then save your scripts in there. Quick.cmd now you can type quick at the command line. It can also be called inside a script using the call function. Subs. If you're really trying to get around something like this, you can use the subst command to map that long path to a separate drive letter. Then, when you want to jump into that folder, you can just type, m column, at the command line. The advantage of this over Doski is that it works in all batch programs, and shows up in any file dialog box within Windows. If you don't want the mapping anymore, You could use the same trick, that Windows uses, set an environment variable, or just a variable in a batch context, for example there is an environment variable percent vendor percent, and some others, so you can do an or, which does the same. So all, you have to do is, After that you can do, from wherever you are, or, or whatever you want.